Hi, Mike Peterson, sales manager at North American Fire Hose. We're in the, uh, our fire hose testing laboratory. I'm with Bernardo Gonzalez, who does a variety of tests uh, that are either required by NFPA or FM or UL, a variety of tests, to be sure that all of our hose is in full compliance. Um, one thing we would like to show you is the adhesion test that's required in NFPA 1961. It's actually, it starts on paragraph 6.6. .6. It's the adhesion test. And we have that set up over here, our, our particular uh, arrangement that's in full, exactly how it's described here. And most holes will pass under normal room temperature. But we're going to show you the effect of what could happen at 158 degrees for three minutes of a EPDM rubber liner that has been put in by the hot glue method uh, right alongside of a, of a liner that's been used with the rubber backing for vulcanization. So, as labeled up there on that rack, the hot glue method is on the right. The rubber backing, which is vulcanization, is on the left. It's not affected by heat whatsoever. Uh, in fact, vulcanization is a chemical and mechanical adhesion process. Where during the steam cure, the chemical reaction takes place, and that rubber backing bonds the EPDM to the inner fibers of the inner jacket and it was not affected by heat. The only way that could possibly come out is you would have to heat it so hot that the fibers would begin to melt and then it would come apart. So thank you for watching. Take care. Bye.